Equilibrium in the money market Money market equilibrium is achieved when the supply of money and demand for money are equal. Money demand is made of two parts. MSP, speculative demand for money. MT, transactionary demand for money. MD equals MSP plus MT. LM curve depicts equilibrium in the money market, L equals M, as well as the bond market, by Walras law. A plot of the equilibrium interest rate for various levels of output or income, within the money market for a given level of the nominal money supply. How LM curve is derived? An increase in income leads, to an increase in the demand for money, at a given interest rate, given the money supply, this increase in the demand for money leads to an increase in the equilibrium interest rate. Equilibrium in the financial markets implies that an increase in income leads to an increase in the interest rate. The LM curve is therefore upward sloping. The figures shows that LM curve is derived by joining equilibrium points of the money market, thus we can say, that, the LM curve is locus of points where money market is in equilibrium. Now, let's have a look at some properties of LM curves. It is upward sloping as seen earlier, increase in income leads to increase in interest rate. Increase slash decrease in the real money supply shift the LM curve rightward slash leftward accordingly. The steepness or flatness of the LM curve describes the elasticity or responsiveness of money demand, L, to the nominal interest rate. Steep LM curve, inelastic. Flat LM curve, elastic. Shifts in LM curve due to change in money supply. The figure shows, an increase in money causes the LM curve to shift down. Hope your doubts are clear, feel free to ask questions in the comments. Also please do like and share the video also hit the subscribe button to stay updated with new videos. Thank you.